Well, Friday football frenzy continues here at Bishop Chatard, and joining me is a RTV6 legend, Bob Sloop McLean. I'm going to give the mic to you. You're going to show us a little something here. He worked for RTV6 for 30 years. Take it over, Bob. Okay, thanks, it. Nicole. Good morning, everybody. A beautiful morning here in central Indiana. You know, the big story, of course, you're all aware of the eclipse coming on uh, Monday. The biggest time of the eclipse. 225 when 90 percent 91 percent of the sun will be covered but remember even if most of the sun is covered do not use any of the sunglasses the regular sunglasses a lot of the young men and women here at bishop chatard are wearing sunglasses right now those are good for football victories but they're not good for viewing the eclipse too much harmful radiation still gets through you know, talking about protection and the kind of protection for the eclipse. A Trojan tempest is developing over here in the western part of the area, and it's going to slide slowly to the east and interact with this fair weather that's right now over Bishop Chatard. So tonight, when Chatard plays Brebeuf, the Trojan tempest will be victorious over the Braves of Brebeuf. So... Go Trojans! Thank you so much. Thank you so much. We appreciate your time. And the Trojans are ready to go tonight for a real win against Rebuff. Lauren, we'll send it back to you. All right, Nicole, thank you so much. Now, this is just one of tonight's matchups. Others include my Center Grove Trojans at Warren Central. Both teams are ranked in the top five of Class 6A. Then we have New Pal at Whiteland, both ranked in 5A. Ben Davis opens at Tech, Southport at Roncalli. Finally, Greenwood will play at Perry Meridian at their new stadium.